Hey guys, Megatimo here again. Today I will be moving away from my normal orc theme to something a little bit different. Uh, a while ago I entered a uh, 500 subscribers competition of the Voodoo Orc and uh, won. So I want to show you guys what I got. I got a Joseph Bugman uh, miniature um, fine cast that uh, he sent me um, because I won the random draw. So anyway, um, I got this from The Voodoo Orc, and uh, you should go check out his channel because he has some pretty good, really good painting tips and some really good painted up models uh, for inspiration. So I thought we'd take a look at it. He, uh, he already opened it, I, I suppose, to make sure it wasn't miscast or anything. But right here we can see Joseph uh, passed out in front of a couple of barrels. There's his little helmet. And there's his little glass. Uh, the casting looks pretty good. I already took a look at it. Um, I don't I don't see anything majorly wrong with it. So there would be the back of the barrels and his little pipe along with his axe which is sitting on the back of the barrels. So I'm going to put this together, uh, clean it up, and we'll be back in a second to take a look at it. And we're back. So I got the little guy together. Uh, he's not glued to his face, but um, all in all, uh, pretty detailed model. Um, when I was putting them together, I did notice some. Yeah, you know, let's get some of the point with. I did notice some pieces on the barrel were not so great looking, but uh, that wasn't so bad. There is one little piece, and I don't know if you guys can see it on the camera because my camera's not good enough. But right here, in his eye or his eyebrow, uh, there's a bubble. So it kind of took out his eyebrows, so I'm gonna have to fill that, and hopefully, hopefully I can make that look better. But the rest of him looks pretty good. Uh, his little pint glass here, and his pipe. Uh, a little bit of need to fill that in, but uh, all in all, he looks pretty good. So I'm gonna try to paint this guy, um, basically because he looks awesome. And uh, it's pretty good because my favorite fantasy creature are dwarves, but uh, next to that it's orcs. So if they had squats in 40k, I'd probably be playing them. <laughs> um, the only downside is I don't really know how to paint not green skin because I never really bothered learning. So if anybody knows, uh, can link me some uh, good tutorials or something, that'd be really helpful. I think I'm just going to paint them pretty much the same as he is on the front of the package which I showed at the beginning. So nothing too extravagant there, hopefully. Um, it'll look something like that. <laughs> anyway, uh, if you got any tips or anything, uh, let me know. Let me know what you think of this model. And uh, one more last thank you to The Voodoo Orc, or Rob. Um, Thanks again for this. Uh, like you said, it's kind of hard to get some of these models over here on this side of the pond. Um, and for everyone else who hasn't uh, heard of the Voodoo Orc, uh, you should go check out his channel. I'll leave a link in the description below.